Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Cisco Packet Tracer 8.2.2 on Windows 11 operating system. But the process is same on all Windows operating systems. First go to Cisco Network Academy site that is netrecord.com. Hit enter. See here, title, it is Cisco Network Networking Academy. Learn Cyber Security Python and more. See, we don't have option to download but now click on this explore go to the bottom in this menu see here we have the cisco packet tracer click on it then click on getting started with cisco packet tracer click on it then see here we have the module one download and use cisco packet tracer now now click on install cisco packet tracer see download cisco packet tracer is not clickable so for that first we have to register so Click on login, then we have to sign up. Click on sign up, then we have to fill all these details. Once you fill all these details, we will receive email for confirmation. Okay, once registration is done, then come to this page again. Go back again, login, then provide email and password. So I have already registered, so I'm logging in. Once login, again, you have to come to this Cisco packet tracer. Then you have to click on get started. Then you have to enroll the course. Then go to the course. Click on resume course. I have already registered. Then you have to click on this download Cisco packet tracer. Then we have to click on this NetAcard resources lab downloads. Click on this link. Scroll down. See here. Learning resources. Download the version of packet tracer you require. See here we have the packet tracer 8.2.2, 8.2.2, Windows 64 bit. So click on it. See once, once we click on download started. Go to downloads. See size is 228 megabytes. Wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then click on this packet tracer exe file. Click on it. Then set the I accept the agreement. It is a license agreement. Then select the check radio box and click on next. And this will be the installation directory. If you want to change some other location, select browse and select the path. Okay, I'm okay with the default one. So click on next. This will be the name in the start menu folder. Then click on next. If you want to create desktop shortcut or if you want to create a quick launch shortcut, you have to select the check boxes. Otherwise, unselect them and click on next. This is the installation summary like destination folder and start menu folder locations so click on if you are okay with the, the settings and click on install see installation has been started see setup is completed if you want to launch packet tracer you have to select the checkbox and click on finish otherwise unselect it and click on finish now go to all applications see here it has created a cisco packet tracer folder Click on drop down, then see here we have this scope packet tracer. Click on it. Now it is asked, would you like to run multi user when application starts? Click on yes, it is up to you. Now we have to log in. Click on skills for all. See, you have successfully logged into the Cisco packet tracer. You may close the tab. Okay, now go to here. Even if you close it, close this one. See, we are able to connect. Okay. And see here, this is the Cisco Packet Tracer application. See here, we have two options. Logical and physical. Okay. So, and also see here, in, in the bottom, network devices, end devices. See here, we have the routers, switches, hubs, etc. If you click on end devices, see here, we have the PC, laptop, server, and connections see we have different connection types okay folders etc options are there okay so click on end devices then drag here and unlogical then select other devices connect them by using any of these cable connection types like cables so i'm going to connect these two select on this one then select on other device see green means it is connected want to see the properties now click on any of these devices see here we have the like desktop 
see we have different options like terminal command prompt firewall settings text editor see email etc options are there now we can practice all these options by going to the course that you registered okay so in this video we have seen how to download and install cisco packet tracer 8.2.2 on windows 11 operating system for more tutorials please subscribe my channel thank you